Malami and Senate President Ababio face prosecution as pressure mounts on EFCC boss to get them arrested. Tinubu declares, of course, these two people, these two people, with one other person, Matawali, a former governor, supposed to be arraigned. He's supposed to be arraigned. Um, on the issue of uh, uh, on the issue of uh, Malami, he has numerous crimes committed while he was in office, and this supposed to have been checked for a very long time, but because of politics, he was just left. Then uh, Akbabio, in fact, embezzlement of all kinds. Before going to the contents, let me salute every one of you listening to this very broadcast. Every one of you that have been watching and listening to our videos, you are awesome. You are wonderful people. Thank you so much. Um, I promise you, we'll always be here to be giving it to you back to back as we have always been doing. All right, but before you go into the content for the new ones, don't forget to click on the red subscribe button to, uh, to subscribe so that each time we upload any new videos, you will be updated. Let's go back to the content. This is today's news. There is pressure from stakeholders in the country on the executive chairman of the Economic and Financial Crime Commission, EFCC, Ola Olukoyedi, to investigate and prosecute former Attorney General of the Federation and Minister of Justice, Abubakar Malami, incumbent President of the Senate, Godswill Akbabio, the Minister of State for Defense, Bilo Matawale, former governor of Zamfara State, among others. A particular stakeholder reminded the EFCC chairman of his vow to resign his appointment if he was not allowed to prosecute former governor Yahya Bilo of Kogi State. According to stakeholders, Shew Midi, by the way, when are you resigning? On your honor since Yaya Bilo has gone free with Kogi stolen money. The stakeholder told the EFCC chairman to release Godwin Emefili if he cannot prosecute the identified persons. Which is true. Which is true. Very much true. Because these persons that have just been mentioned right now, their own crime is even worse than that of Emefele. Worse than that, than that of Emefele. You see, you are leaving them because they are key figures who worked in the office of your predecessor. But it doesn't go that way. If you can't arrest Emefele, then you should be able to arrest these persons too. You understand? You should be able to arrest them too. All right. Um, this is how I feel, my people. I don't know about you, but please um, don't forget your comments. They are still very much of great importance. Don't forget to click on the red subscribe buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos. Thank you.